In this tutorial, we're going to be showing you how to use this VPOS emote to glitch through walls that are really high studs, and how to speed glitch with it. This emote is free in a game called Tommy Play where you will have to do a quest to get it. I'll make sure to have the game in the description down below. When you get in the game, you want to go to chapter 2 and then press travel. After this cutscene, you will spawn on top of this platform. You want to head over to the arrows that are pointing to the word quest. Once you get to the area to get the quest, you want to talk to this guy who will tell you to find a giant pretzel. All you want to do is follow where I'm going. Now to actually get the VPOSE emote, you will have to get other emotes before to get to it. Once you get up here, you're going to want to follow this railroad track that's on top of the bridge. Once you get near the end of the bridge, you will have to do some parkour jumps to get over. Once you get over here, you'll see that there's a giant pretzel. And once you get to it, all you want to do is hold down E. Once you hold down E and got the pretzel, you're on the reset. And once you reset, it should spawn you back to the spawn point. And all you want to do is go to the quest person to get the next quest. Once you talk to him and got the next quest, all you want to do is follow where I go next. All you want to do is go up here. Then once you get up here, you're going to want to go on top of these clouds to go up. Once you go into this building, there should be the giant pretzel, then you can reset and go back to the quest person to get the next quest. After you talk to him, you want to go to the bottom left corner, click on the play GUI, and then go to parkour. Then you want to follow where I'm going. Once you collected the pretzel and go back to the quest person, you can get your next quest, which will be the quest for the VPOs. Now all you want to do is follow where I'm going. This will be the quest for the VPOs, which is the emote that we're using for the glitch today. The VPOs is actually the second last quest, so there actually is another quest after this for another emote, which I will show just in case if you guys want to collect another emote. For this, you basically want to jump up and press R to dash if you're on PC. And then you want to just jump on this block here, and then jump on these. And then you want to head over to these clouds over here, go to the building, and then you can see over there that you can see a pretzel and that's what we're going to go for which will give you the vpose emo after you collect it and go to the person to get the badge for the emo once you collected the pretzel you want to head over to the quest person to get the badge which will give you the vpose emo this next emo is the uprise emo i'm just going to speed up this video just in case if anyone wants this emo after this clip showing how to get the last emo for this quest we're going to show you how to glitch with the vpose which is super worth it because it's not just clipping through just walls it also has insane speed boost which i'm excited to show you guys so once you collected this pretzel you can reset go back to the quest person and you get the uprise emo now when you go to animations go to emotes you can equip the emote and then you can equip the V pose, and you can put in any slot that you want. And by doing all those quests, you just saved 850 Robux on all these emotes. Once you did that, you want to put body type to 100%, go to body, then scale, and copy these scale settings that I have on the screen right now. The first thing you want to do is go to the Roblox logo in the top left corner, go to settings, and make sure you have shift lock switch on. Put your back against the wall, and face your character on the right side of your character. Equip your emo, and once your character does a handstand, you want to press shift and D at the same time. Just with these skill settings that are free that I showed on the avatar customization, you can go up to 4 studs. Once you go to 5 studs, it's also free. But all you want to do is change the legs to city life woman legs and change your torso to the woman torso. I'll have the link to those in the description down below of this video. This emo is able to go up to 7 studs without any gears. Now for the insane speed glitch. Press on the emote and equip your item when you do the handstand. Press S in space and quickly freeze your screen and press W and D and shift then unfreeze your screen. This was done without FPS unlocker, but with FPS unlocker you can get higher speeds than these. Thanks for watching and peace.